In this video, I want to show you how you can use uh, Excel to calculate the fine number summary, which is the minimum, lower quartile, median, upper quartile, and maximum. So minimum, to calculate minimum, so here we want to find, so let's focus on income. So this, this is the income of New Zealanders. This is the, I have already sorted this. This is 44,000. This is an annual income to this is one seven two four thousand so which is one million seven hundred and twenty four thousand okay so without suppose there are 50 data here so you can see very easily the median would be between the 25th and the 26th so the median has to be 532.5 okay so how to find minimum you don't obviously you can see the minimum is 44 but let's do it so equal minimum min uh, start with the bracket and you have to highlight the data so highlighting the data and then close the bracket we know it's 44 for lower quartile you go to equal quartile close the bracket sorry open bracket highlight the data Highlight the data, it's taking too long. And then comma, lower quartile is your first quartile. So you have to do comma one and then close the bracket. So that will 374. Median, you can, there's a formula for median. So equal median. Median you can also do by using quartile. Median is the second quartile. So highlight the data and then close the bracket okay so that will give you median 532.5 that's what i said it should be between the 52 52nd sorry 25th and the 26th data which is 532 and for upper quartile you go quartile open bracket highlight the data most of you should be knowing this and this is your third quartile and close the bracket enter and for maximum equal maximum bracket highlight the data we know it's 1724 but we are just looking at how to use excel it's 1724 now the big question is, you can draw box and whisker using this. If you say the median, so our focus is to look at median. So if you say the median income in New Zealand based on this sample of 50 is say 532.5 or it's 532,000, sorry 53,250 is that a proper conclusion so if you take smaller samples from this population you'll find the median would be around this value and that's what confidence interval is which w which we'll talk in the later lessons